Hold on, I wanted to check and see. Star knives. I got the Mainith Monado. They are kind of cool. Did I? What? I thought I had shit equipped. I swear I had things equipped. Oh, did it take them off because of uh, that Monado? That's annoying. I'm just gonna follow the yellow line. It'll uh, it'll be better if I do that. You hear that? The piano. That's sick. I uh, I don't always have the audio up super high, but if you can hear that, you know, the good stuff. The music in this game is pretty good. All right, going up. I can't fast travel anywhere, so that's that's fun. But yeah, whatever. Now oh, this is just giving me anxiety. <laughs> there we go. Hey, yes, the Dew Beetle. I don't like that. I can't jump very high. Ah. It appears I can drop down there somehow. If I really want to. I'm not going to. But I can if I want to. I gotta go back to my ship. Surprised it's still hanging out here. It hasn't been attacked at all. Music is good though. All right. Hello. Hi. I'm ready to go. Yes, we shall go back to the village, please. I will not be coming back here at the moment. Du, 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 du. Stubborn mortals, so desperate to cling to your pathetic lives, even when there is no hope for you. Oh, I'll well, be fine. Hello? Apparently not. Never. But hear this, Danza. They will judge me not in life, but death. Yeah! Ooh, in the gut. No! Well. Shulk. For both our worlds, you must succeed. Well, I hope he does. Very nice, very nice. 
Very sad, but very nice. <gasps> the Maconis. Yeah, that's gone. I'm not going back there. Look, Starboard. What's that cloud? Lots of spooky things. Is it Dixon? Dixon! Oh, it's a bunch of Telethia. Where do they all Telethia. come from? Oh, that's a big boy. Hi, big boy. Oh, Dixon! You're not getting away. Dixon! I'll fight you to Dixon. the death, sir. It's over. Time for you all to return to the Bionis. Nice I fight you right now. <laughs> Why, Dixon? What made you like this? Shulk looked up to you, respected you. Dixon, don't let Zanza control you. Wake up. You can quit He's never family. been Dixon, though, and hasn't I'm he? Total control. I've always been like this. Ever since long before any of you lot were born. Before we were born? Now you get it. It's just like Eggle said. I'm Lord Zanza's disciple. Dixon of the Trinity! <laughs> of the Trinity! <laughs> I know this is probably fine. Bunch of tanks and everything. You wanna get behind him? I'll get behind him. Am I not? Hey, there we go. Man, Ryan has a bunch of HP. Okay, I'll, let me get behind you. Uh, huh. Would like you to heal. But if you're not gonna do that, I guess whatever. Oh, you're not gonna let me encourage you? Okay. Alright, well. Ow! I'm, I'm literally, I can't move. This sucks. Is it just gonna make me redo the fight? Maybe I should have had Sharla. Oh, we're supposed to lose. You waste of space. Not so tough without Shulk, eh? Stupid beast. Who's he calling beast? You should be grateful. Not everyone has a war buddy like me to lead them along. Tasted good, didn't they? The victory drinks we used to share. I'll kill you! What? Whoa, hey, who's that? Who was that? Show yourself! Melia, are you alright? Brother! Kalyan! Dixon! He works for the Bionis! He shot Shulk in the back! Is this true? Yeah? Dixon? This ends here. Your Telethia are no match for our Havrez squadron. You cannot win! Maybe you should be concentrating on your own people instead of barking at me. Nah. Looks like you've forgotten your destiny. Right? Lorathea? What? Lorathea? Are you involved in this as well? Your Highness. Oh yeah, she was your evil, huh? Your is quite charming, but it is also your undoing. But she was in that position. <laughs> I had much fun playing with you and your father. What? What is this fight? What's she doing? Ether particles emitted so that the Bionis can be destroyed and reborn. Uh-huh. <laughs> What do you get if you cross high concentrations of ether with high emptiness? Uh. You wouldn't, Lorathea. 
Awaken, my is she turning everyone into Telethia? Oh, ew. Dude, that's horrifying. That's actually horrifying. Telethia. Oh, no, not Callian. Understand, child. This is the reason why High and Tear are born. Do not blame poor old me. Explain yourself. It's just like she says. The High and Tear are a race created by Lord Zanza to eliminate any annoying life forms ah. in the preparation for the rebirth of the Bionis. Their bodies contain a gene that, when the time comes, transforms them into Telethia. <laughs> It can't be. Say it isn't so. Sad. It is true. Sad, sad. That is why you are our only hope. Brother? Whatever. We won't be needing a half-breed like you anyway. I mean, if you don't turn into a Telethia, it just means you're going to get crushed by one. That's the only thing you're good for. <gasps> Rise up, pet. Do my bidding. Kill your lovely sister. All right then. That's uh that's a brutal sound. That's too, it's too late. So sorry. I always placed such a heavy burden on you. Don't say such things, brother. But at least I can still shoulder the destiny of our people. The burden meant for you brings a tear to my eye. These moments are to be treasured. <gasps> How? What, <laughs> Callian? Yo. My boy. My boy. Everyone's just sacrificing themselves. Alright. Is, is that chapter 17 now? Alright. Chapter 17. Okay. Okay. Shulk, what are you doing in outer space? Hello? Where am I? Oh. So I'm... You're not dead. <laughs> <laughs> What was I doing? What was the purpose of my life?
There's a butt ton of cutscenes. Got it wrong. I was never alive. It was Zanza. All along. I everything I did was. Do you want to say pointless? Al Alvis? That voice. Nobody else can decide that. What are you doing here? Only you. What the heck are you doing here, boyo? I'm still alive. Shulk. Here. Mikol made you a wonderful new weapon. Oh. Since you lost your Monado, I mean. It uses the latest Machina technology. Use it when you wake up. Then, let's all go on living. But what if I don't want to wake up? What about that? We've relocated the Hyentia and the Nopon refugees to Colony 6. Thankfully, the Mekon did us a favor by fortifying it for us. It should hold out for a while. It's ironic. We want to escape Zanza, but we can't leave his body, the Bionist. Well, this is our home. Princess, I have to know. Should we be worried about the evacuated Hyentia? I cannot be sure, but I believe not. Uh, All be those fine. who survived are part Homs like me. Understood. If they ever do transform, I will be among them. If that time comes, you know what to do. Are you sure? Everyone is obliged to accept their fate. No way. There's no way Callion would leave the fate of the Hyentia to you if that was going to happen. Precisely. And Melia, if we are to survive, we must fight Zanza and the Telethia. It may not be the case with all of them, but a large number of Telethia were once high into here. Your subjects and your brethren. Uh -huh. I am prepared for that. Even if it means harming my brethren, it is for the protection of the survivors. That is the final wish of my father and brother. I will fight to free the souls stolen by Zanza. You're a fighter, Melia. We will need all your strength in the fight ahead. Ha! <laughs> oh, sometimes the way they walk oh, in this game is a little odd. He's going to make it. His wound has closed. I think Maynith used the last of her power to protect him. So he's okay. I hope so. Is tending to him now. Fiora, he won't wake up. It's like his consciousness has sunk to the bottom of a cold, dark lake. Mm. I keep saying his name, but he doesn't respond. Sansa's gonna pay for this. What if the Telethia attack? Then we'll have to fight without Shulk. That's why we've strengthened our defenses. That weapon I made should come in handy as well. We're backed into a corner. Nicole. Give it all we've got. Michael? Nicole. Can your resistance truly achieve anything? What do you mean by that, Alvis? Exactly what I said. We were all born of the Bionis, of Zanza. It is Zanza's will that the Telethia return us to the body from whence we came. Whether we die of old age or in battle, we all eventually return to the Bionis. Mm -hmm. We cannot escape this fate. Am I wrong? You've got it backwards, man. Just because he thinks it doesn't make it so. We decide whether to keep living or not. I agree. Even though he's our creator, that doesn't afford him the right to take our lives on a whim. But that is the thinking of a Homs. 
he is a god. Such morals cannot apply to gods. So you think we should just shut up and die? If that is the fate decided by a god. You are mistaken if you think we will simply accept such a fate and wait to die. We'll never stop fighting, not till the end. To Zanza, the outcome is the same. Thus, your logic is flawed. It ain't the outcome that's important. It's the will to fight back. Even if you die in vain. Alvis! Whose side are you on? You scared or something? Frightened of a few Telethia? Stop this. There's no point fighting amongst ourselves. <sighs> Fiora? <sighs> Sorry. I need to go and get some air. I mean, it looks looks like you're breathing pretty good with all that skin showing. Oh, it's just 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 me. Just smell ya. Hi. Hello. I mean, I'll take your quest, Dulland. Okay. Alright, I'll do some crap for you. Hurry up. Yeah, why not? Okay. I don't... Oh, we're in Colony 6 now. Okay. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, over there. I'm going. I really need to upgrade Colony 6 at some point. Get everything taken care of. Probably do that. I'll probably go and search for all the items later. I need to find a stupid bunch of things. Oh, what do we got over here? Bunch of heart to hearts, huh? Are you up? Do I have to go up? Oh no, it's just outside the door. A Dober Corgi! Alright, where'd you go, Fiora? I gotta talk to you. Hi. Fiora, are you all right? Guess I wasn't hiding it well. I didn't want to worry anyone. It must be difficult living with that body. I'm getting more and more used to it. But people still look at me funny. Oh, it's not that bad. It I mean, you feels pretty comfortable, actually. You look the I same. Don't worry about food or anything like that. I see. This body, the energy from the chest component made it work. It turned out to be a monado. Such a strange feeling. A monado? Was that the monado that Zanza took from Nene? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Will your body cease to function? I'll be fine for now. There's still some stored energy left. But then what? You run out of energy? Oh, Melia. If I ever... Please take care of Thor. Don't talk like that. How can you ask me such a thing? Sorry. I'm sorry. There's no need to apologize. You're right. Thank you, Melia. Shulk awakes. Do you tell him? No. He worries too much anyway. <laughs> he does worry. It's just like him. Actually, I'm already dead. I have been since the Mechon attacked. Fiora, 
but I'm happy now. This body has given me the chance to live. Maybe I don't have much time left, but at least I can be with Shulk for a little while longer. Do you feel that strongly for him? Yes. That's why I'll fight on and help him in any way I can. Everyone will start worrying. Yes, you are right. And Melia, can you keep it secret from the others? You do not want them to worry. I admire your strength. Maybe I'll tell him, but only when the time is right. I won't say a word. Nothing compared to her. Oh. A siren. Fiora, let's hurry back. Okay. All right. Well, this is where I save it, everyone. Thank you for watching, and remember to keep uh, watching the videos and subscribing to the channel if you want to see more. As always, stay awesome, and I will see you guys next time.